Kyra is the medic. She keeps the team alive. The healing grenade launcher creates radial blasts of healing energy. The acceleration field accelerates Kyra and those around her to blistering speeds. The napalm grenade launcher deals fire damage to the enemy. Don't forget to use the healing burst. How's the research coming, Kyra? Nothing you want to hear. Try me. Well, I certainly don't think we've seen everything these creatures can do. Given the forms and abilities we've seen so far, I'd say it's likely they can adapt anything necessary to beat us. Okay, you're right. I didn't want to hear that. Told you. All right, Jay Party. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, hunters of all ages and monsters of all stages, this is DB Sinclair with Jay Party. And we're bringing you another match of Evolve here, showing some of the newer content we just released. On a new map as well, Jay Party, Orbital Drill. Yeah, absolutely. We were practicing that before ma the match. Orbital. Ah, very good word. Orbital, orbital, orbital drill here with a new, another new hunter, Jay Party. Yeah, look at that Kyra here, the new medic. And God, I love this medic. The grenade barrage, all of her forms come in the way of giant explosives here. Uh, right now, you're looking at the incendiary grenade, her offensive weapon. And boy, is it effective. It's going to light a large area on fire and get that damage over time going on the monster as well as any wildlife. Yeah, it's pretty cool, Jay Party. She has one gun. It just switches the cartridges out. It basically rotates, and she goes from napalm grenade to the healing grenade. She can actually shoot herself and her teammates with that healing grenade, heal them up. She also has the class ability heal burst, as uh, we've seen with Val and Lazarus. And then finally, that acceleration field that you mentioned before, that's going to get your whole team moving in a grooving on their way to hunting the monster. Yeah, that is just so effective. Sometimes people underutilize the speed perk in this game, and being able to give it to your entire team at the same time in random bursts is just so helpful there. As you saw her shooting some of those healing grenades, it's super easy to switch back and forth. Oh, what a pounce wow. from the monster. Where's the team here? Help your medic. Get him off there. Nicely done by the monster to pounce the medic mid-air. Yeah, absolutely a great play there, and he gets the damage he needs. The team was just not ready to respond. And you got to watch out for that in Evolve. I love it. It's part of the admin flow. People get so stuck on supporting your teammates using those help items. You forget that you need to keep a weapon on hand there and look for those pounce attacks. Down goes support with a big slam a jamma to the ground in the paw of Goliath. Luckily enough, though, support dragged Goliath away from the rest of the team. They are finally getting the medic up. This organization is the key to a disastrous start for the Hunters, but they seem to have recovered here, Jay Party. And that was such a good play there. It gave the monster the time to breathe, even with that arena up. He's going to get out fine now. And with a new cooldown to wait for, even though he's only got two bars left, he's got some safety here. It's going to give him the time to hopefully get this evolved and get to stage two. And boy, does he need it. That health bar just so low at this point. Goliath on the run, taking a nice little acid bath there, Jay Party. That is an acid pool. Uh, on this map that you will find uh, sort of around the edges and in towards the middle of the map, uh, which will damage both the hunters and the monster if they decide to swim or walk through there. Yeah, gotta watch out for all those environmental hazards as we've seen it just take down whole teams by itself there as a bunch of Reavers are picking on our medic here. Lucky for Kyra, she's got strong AoE clearance and that's super unique to her on the medic field there. Not a lot of medics have that good AoE clear. It's one of the strengths of Kyra as well as the ability to heal, heal herself with her healing grenades. That's another one of the major perks of being Kyra as we're seeing that speed perk here just allow the hunters to cruise across this map. Yeah, nicely done. Another thing it does for you, Jay Party, it allows you to run on the ground. When you run on the ground your jetpack is constantly filling back up with fuel and it's ready so when you have that acceleration burst going you're able to fly towards your target and then when you need to use your jetpack it's always on the ready nicely done by Kyra here oh except uh, poor timing from the trapper <laughs> on the dome trapped everybody but the monster yeah. J party <laughs> that was rough slowing the hunters down by a couple seconds there lucky for them they still have tracking on this monster that's so important for them to get true sight of the monster it allows you to really cut him off and allows you to predict his movement which is so important as a hunter yeah nicely done with the dust tagging let's see if the trapper can get up there and get some stasis grenades on him also using that uh tracking dart gun 
to track the monster that way as well. If you double up on those and you have them outlined in the yellow and you have the tracking darts in them as well, you, that monster's going to have a hard time ditching you. But right now, they don't seem to be on the same page with that. And the monster is free to move around. Big rock throw misses, though. Yeah, Abe, sticking to those grenades there, and wants to just slow the monster down. As you can see there, just getting to a slow crawl as the monster has nowhere to really run here. He needs to escape from this area as that armor is gone, and he's taking direct damage to his healthier. Yeah, this is actually great work, finally, from the hunters. You see the stasis grenade slowing the monster down. He was even in a pit of acid at one point there. So he's taking acid. He's taking constant damage. Uh, there's the... Uh, damage amplifier from support there on the monster, allowing the entire team to do extra damage, and now the monster under half health. Hey, we'll see if the hunters can catch up to him, as this is such a big moment for them. If they can just catch him one more time before he evolves, they're guaranteed a win here, but let's see if they can do it, as this Goliath is playing smart here, getting a little bit of food, but he needs to stay on the move, needs to keep building that armor, and just stay out of the fight. He finally does get a little bit of armor, as you see some of those napalm grenades flying above his head, nicely done by Kyra, before she went down back there. Medic was down, though, now on two strikes. Let's see how the team comes back from this. And there's Kyra keeping everyone at full health. She does healing such a good job awesome. of this. That AOE healing is so powerful for keeping your team in the fights. I absolutely love it. The difficulty is it is a skill shot heal. And with Val, it's very easy to just target that metagun and you don't have to think a lot about it. But with Kyra, every shot counts. Those grenades are so important and your teammates need that AOE heal to be very efficient to keep everyone fighting. That's right, Jay Party. The flip side to that, though, is that it is an AOE burst. So you can heal multiple targets while Val can only heal one at a time. It's a nice trade-off, though, as playing as Kyra. And look at that. They get the monster tracked again. This Cabot doing such a good job of using that dust tag. It's such a powerful tool. Some would think it's a too large a trade-off to lose that barrage, but having sight of the monster this easily is just so important for any team. They got him right where they want him now. Finally get him in the dome as the trap are starting to do work. You see the damage amplifier from support there. And the medic, though, getting caught up as she's trying to heal and napalm the monster, getting caught in the uh, against the wall there. Uh-oh. They are in the pool of acid, pushed back into there. And did he go down, Jay Party? No, he's getting back, finally, the Trapper. Yeah, it makes that out of there. Neither of them want to be in that high damage area for too long as it's going to bring you down. And oh, there goes the Trapper. And with that goes the arena. The monster now able to fight at his leisure and leave when things look bad. Got the team right where he wants them, or does he, Jay Party? He's in the pool of acid. He's got the stasis grenade on him. He's running through mines. The monster having a tough time here, down under three bars of health. Yeah, pushing the hunters into the water, though, such a good strategy, but down to the two and a half bars here. It's just not looking good on this fight. He needs to really focus these last two hunters if he wants to win this one. Yeah, this is a good fight for the hunters, but Assault, though, just hanging out in the pool of acid. He goes down as well. We see strikes all over this hunter team. <laughs> The monster taking a temporary second of reprise there to eat the rest of that meat, get his evolve meter full, and get a little bit of armor in this fight. We'll see if he stays or if he runs away here as the hunters are looking pretty banged up in this fight. Yeah, he's doing great work on them, but they're doing some pretty good work as well. Staying together as a team here, trying to get that damage amp on them. Medic down, Trapper down. Oh, but he misses that game. leap smash there. Oh, but he's still able to interrupt that revive, and that's so important because he missed that leap smash. That would have been the knockback he needed. Lucky for him, he gets that last second there, and he's able to disrupt it and try to kill a hunter. Unfortunately, they don't get the kill, and he's back up and in this fight. Yeah, back up and on the run. Two strikes there, or excuse me, two bars of health for the monster. Two strikes on almost every hunter, though, Jay Party. We've got Support, Assault, and the Trapper in the game. Medic is dead, waiting for the dropship. So we're looking at Abe here using that new tracking gun, and I love this gun. It has a pretty cool, unique ability. You can shoot it into the wildlife, and that's going to not only mark the wildlife, but if the monster ever eats anything marked, he'll be marked as he's eating that tracking dart. Such a cool ability. Allows you to keep tabs on a lot of areas of the map. Mega Mouth gets hold of Assault there. They finally shoot okay. the Mega Mouth, and Assault oh. gets out. Okay. But look how low on health he is without the Medic in the game. Yeah, this is such a rough situation to be in. Lucky for them, that Drapture timer just hit zero, and Kyra is coming back into this map as Assault needs to be so careful here. Just coming next to a fly might kill him as just breathing on him is going to knock him over. He looks like he's just running back to the dropship to say, hey, Kyra, please heal me as soon as you get back in. In fact, the entire team is there at the landing zone waiting for her to drop in. Here she comes. Oh, and she, uh, she drops past the team there. Let's see if she can get a heal burst on them and then use that gun to top off the rest of the hunters. Assault, get Assault up there, get some heals. Down. Just desperate to get these heals off, and I don't blame him. It's so important there. 
He doesn't have a second down penalty, and he doesn't want one. He needs to get his health topped off, and finally they're getting there. This team back on the move here. They finally topped off their health bars, and look at that. That movement speed perk allowing them to just cruise across the map. Yeah, nicely done to use an acceleration field on the entire team. Uh, as Kyra, you normally want to stand towards the back of the group like she's doing right now. This is going to allow you to catch up to the team and uh, actually push them forward with that acceleration field. It also allows you to heal the entire group with that healing grenade gun uh, from behind. Yeah, we'll see that with the monster at stage three, that alternate wind condition, the power relay does open up. Ooh, but they get eyes on him before he gets there. And God, this monster's health has just gotten so much higher than their last encounter here. Up to half his health with full armor. This is going to be a hard fight for the hunters. Trapper gets caught out. Trapper on two strikes. This could be it for him unless he's healed by the medic. Nicely done by the medic to drop those heals. This is a great perch for the medic beat on. And Jay Party, you can see the assault went up there, laid down a mine to keep the medic safe and then went down below and laid some mines down there and that's such an important utility to use here you might not be seeing it but that cabbage damage bonus is being applied to the monster if he ever hits a mine with that up it's going to be huge sums of damage on the monster the medic doing a great job of switching between the healing grenades healing the team and hitting with that uh, damage over time napalm grenade as well as you're seeing here now yeah, she's doing a great job here. The monster realizes this isn't going to work from his current position, and he goes up to clear the top of that ledge, and that's a definitely a key decision for him here as that health bar starting to dwindle. Starting to dwindle, but nice use of all of the utilities from support there, cloaking the teammates, keeping them safe up top. The monster goes back down into that little pit of doom down there where he's trying not to work. The hunters have it locked down really well. Yeah, that rock missing the medic, and that's such an important thing here, but they have to watch out. They're grouping up a little too much down here, and the monster could get a double kill or a triple here. Even a triple, Jay Party, as the trapper, the only one keeping his distance at the moment. Big rock throw oh, misses. Oh, misses. Here comes the follow-up leap smash. Nice dodge by the trapper. The monster, though, down under a bar of health. Health going down. Jay Party, this could be it. This could be a hunter <laughs> win. And it is indeed winner, winner, Goliath for dinner. Orbital drill. Jay Party, what a match. We've seen now Cabot. We've seen Abe. And the feature of the day, Kyra. Nicely done by the Kyra player there, using all those abilities. Jay Party, we'll see him next time. Say goodbye to the world. Thanks again for watching, folks, and we'll catch you next time.